Buddha boarders have made a name for themselves in the transport business as a quick means to get to a destination. The Police Directorate of Traffic and Road Safety says there are hundreds of thousands of border boarders in Kampala alone. They are authorized to carry only one passenger per trip, but with the need to match the ever-rising cost of living, some have been pushed to break the rules. Ramadan Bisaso is the chairperson of Boda Boda Cyclist Stage here at ShopRite along in Tebe Road. The riders fearlessly carry two or more passengers to earn more. In the evenings, at the Queensway roundabout along in Tebe Road, several border borders offer taxi services for those returning home. The peak hours are between 7 and 9 p.m. Most of those who ride do not wear a helmet. With more passengers, the rider will charge half or quarter the price it would cost off peak. Away from accidents, this trend also exposes the motorcyclist and his passengers to the danger of attack. Since July 1st this year, police have been conducting an operation to arrest killers and attackers of border border riders, recovering up to 70 stolen motorcycles, some of which had been dismantled for spare parts. You must carry not more than one passenger. If you do so, the offense is required, is called pillion riding. That means carrying more than one passenger on a motorcycle. And the, the fine will be given thereafter. However, when we go even practical terms, in riding of a motorcycle, it, it, the, the rider must be seated on, on the seat together with the passenger. Should you put two passengers that seat, then you both sit on, on the tank. You can't control that motorcycle next to a passenger. We shall charge him for accepting to be carried in an, an unsafe manner. The riders say that though they are trying to earn more, their border borders suffer wear and tear that comes from carrying more than the recommended weight. Private companies have taken it upon themselves to provide services as per the rule book, training their riders and ensuring that they carry only one passenger, providing a helmet for them and using technology which helps them to avoid attacks as they have information about their customers.